The Wyvern Ignition Impact Greatsword at this time is being considered as the best greatsword by most players, including me, and it is the best looking greatsword in my opinion. You can get this weapon by doing the Every Hunter Stream event quest. Let's look at the stats. It is a Rarity 7 greatsword which can be augmented twice, a raw power of 1008, a small white sharpness, negative 15% affinity, a hidden 510 fire element, and it has two level 1 gem slots. Now for the build. This build will be focusing on maxing out damage and it will depend on what gems you have available. First is to remove the negative 15% affinity with maximum might for your critical eye. Using the Nergigante Greaves Beta and Helm Alpha will give maximum might level 3 and attack boost level 1. Kushal assists the Beta for the Hunter Cuff level 2 which further increases white sharpness. The Kaiser Vam vs Beta giving weakness exploit level 1 and with a uh, weakness exploit level 2 charm for that level 3. Now 50% affinity will be added whenever hitting a weak, a weak spot. Lastly, the Nergigante Call Beta will give attack boost 2 and having 3 Nergigante armor pieces will give the Nergigante Hunger which heals you whenever you hit a monster but varies per weapon. With this armor set along with the greatsword, we have 3 level 2 gem slots, 1 level 3 gem slots, and 3 level 1 gem slots. I added 3 critical boost gems, 1 element plus, 2 attack gems, 1 grinder gem. If I had another attack gem, I would switch out the grinder gem. Now we have a total of attack boost 5, critical boost 3, witness exploit 3, handcraft 2, speed sharpening 1, and non elemental boost. When hitting weak spots with full stamina, it will have a 70% chance to crit and with critical boost, crit damage is increased. Keep in mind that the shoulder tackle uses stamina and blocking also drains stamina and decreases sharpness greatly when hit. Maximum Might works well with Greatsword since you can regain stamina while charging and usually you are at full stamina when fully charged. As for augments, I would choose increased affinity and increased attack. Well, that's my build for the Wyvern Ignition Impact Raid Sword. Hope it helps you out and feel free to comment below what you think about this build. Thanks for watching.